So now it's finally good to catch up with you. As I've told you before, I was a big fan of your dad some 25 years ago, which makes me feel so old. But anyway, <laughs> so how's it feel to be in Manchester playing in it's, it, your hometown? Because a lot of people don't realise that you're a local guy. Yeah, no, it is a big deal for me playing back in my hometown, especially you knowing my dad played and has you know, such a, a, a huge reputation out here. And, you know, made his name known, um, so I'm just glad I can hold my own weight over here, you know, like a proud. Yeah, so it's nice to play rookie season in Manchester as a giant, and in front of your granddad as well, which is a really nice thing for you too. Yeah, yeah, no, my granddad, you know, I love him to death. Um, he's always been there, you know, he doesn't know too much about the sport, but, you know, he's always supported me, and, you know, I love him for that. Sure. So tonight's game, it felt like you've been building up to this a little bit. How was it for you? Because I know you probably you, you're sort of looking at your numbers, going like, "I've not played a lot of minutes in this game, but I'm getting into this game a little bit more." Tonight, I feel like you want it to be this is the kind of role that you want to have for this team. Yeah, no, I definitely, you know, always am staying ready, so I don't have to, you know, get ready. Um, I preach myself on that, you know, staying at you know, practice and shooting sure. you know, that extra hour, just really putting that, you know, the time and the effort in. So when I do come out here, you know, I make an impact in a positive way um, and I lift up the team. I mean, this is a really, really fast and athletic team, and I've been saying on the podcast for a while now that this team will kill you in transition. There's more of that tonight. What it seems always is like it's the third quarter at the moment. You notice that in the third quarter, for some reason, the team seems to come back into it a little bit. Plymouth again look for a minute like they might be right back into it. What's the mindset of the team when it happens like that in the third? Um, I think, you know, we just come out a little flat. Um, but, you know, during practice, you know, we'll look at it and see. Um, but it really is just that first four minutes, you know, we usually say the first four minutes is, you know, is going to set the tone early. Yeah. Um, and so the last two games, we haven't really won those first four, um, which brings them back in the game. Uh, but we always find a way to, you know, finish it out in the fourth. Yeah. No, it's really great having you here in Manchester. I was so excited when I saw that you were coming. Enjoy it, man. Thank you. Thank you. All right.